everyone this is Pamela and well this is not the first time uh, for the ones who is the first time they're seeing me uh, well this is my name and if you want to know uh, more about me like I always said you can look uh, or watch sorry to the last video the previous videos and where you can find out about the story of my life and why I decided just to uh, start this type of content uh, on YouTube and um, you know I feel really excited just to make this type of material because I don't know it's um, something that I see like a hobby that it makes me feel really good relief and it is a healing process that I take into account in order for me just to become a better version of myself and help others and and you know it makes me happy at least to have one view that I'm, I'm hoping that I can help that person just to you know, open their eyes into a new situation. So well, and I have been doing these videos where I give information about, you know, any type of topic that is related, you know, to psychology, to, you know, behaviors and all this stuff. But I, you know, I was thinking during the week that I wanted to change a little bit of the content by, you know, adding more, you know, excitement into this. And I wanted just to, or I was thinking into putting some context or maybe in soap operas, uh, Kardashians that, you know, it, it, they are very popular right now and, you know, other type of videos where I'm going to be analyzing the context of, of a fight or a situation that can be really, um, you know, toxic and everyone uh, sometimes is following up and trying to imitate those type of behaviors that, to me, my point of view, are not actually really good. So I'm going to start, oh, the first video that I would like to analyze is about the fight of Kim and Carney that was really popular back at, you know, uh, at the beginning of the year, okay? And, um, you know, I watched the fight and I, I, I saw many things that I, I realized that there were a very, you know, toxic a behavior there. Of course, uh, that leads to a, you know, violent situation that I do not recommend people just to go that because I think everyone deserves respect and you know being violent is not that solution for anyone and that's why like I want to clarify that I, I'm not going to say that she was right and she deserved it because I don't think that's the point of all that so what I want to just to call out a little bit of a behavior that I, I, I saw there that I just wanted uh, people to realize maybe the people who didn't see it the way I saw it Anyways, you have or you are really open just to, you know, put your comment below and tell me whatever you think of it, okay? So, um, I want you just to watch the video and I'm going to be comment as you watch the video and, and then we can, um, you know, I, I can tell you what I, re um, I perceive from the fight. Okay? When I'm sick or not. I just said mom is so used to it and then I said me, Courtney, me and Chloe. Do, you know, whenever, if we're sick, you don't care about stuff. Like, if she, if it's a but Saturday. But you act like I don't do sh Do you know all I f***ing, you have this, this door, narrative in your I'm mind. Not of, saying that no, you no, 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 I will literally f*** you up. <laughs> if you mention it again, literally shut the f*** up and don't laugh like that. You look like a freak. Okay. But honestly, change the narrative in your mind. I work my f***ing ass off. I just, I, I don't want to hear this narrative anymore about this work ethic and she's the only one with work ethic and she's doing this, this, and this as if she's better because she works more or because like it's such bullshit. Because I don't know if you realize that Kim made a comment that, you know, bothers to Courtney a lot. It triggers her and I think it triggers her because if you're very familiarized with the show, you can tell that they have been having issues, um, you know, from last seasons. And, you know, I have seen it in, in like short clips um, on Instagram or I don't know, because I don't watch the, the channel anymore, uh, in entertainment, that's the channel where the show is being uh, tuned. Um, but in Instagram, I have seen that they have been having these issues with these situations that are very toxic. And then Courtney go, I'm sorry, Kim goes and say this thing about like, oh, um, Courtney, no, Chloe and I, like they, she speaks, and then Courtney felt triggered. And then she just called, her, called out whatever she said, or Kim said, by saying like, you have to stop with their narrative. 
Maybe because she is very responsible, she works really hard and she's tired of her sister saying that it's not that way, which I feel like it's not fair either. So I'm not saying with this that I justify uh, Courtney's actions on, you know, taking it on Kim like she did. But I do not support Kim either because she started everything by saying something to, um, you know, intentionally her Courtney. And I think everyone has seen it in the way it is. And, um, but anyway, I do not justify both of them going to the violent situation because for fighting, you need two people to do it. So they both did it. And other situation that I'm seeing there is that there is a triangulation between Chloe, Courtney, and Kim. And Chloe is taking sides, and you can see clearly that her side is supporting Kim. And, um, you know, I can see that Courtney is really affected by it because at the end she feels like, oh, why are you just calling me out? Uh, like, only me. Um, where Kim also started this and she started saying these things, and then she's just. Don't ever come at me like that. You don't, I stop. swear to God, I'll punch you in your face. So do it. Don't f with me. Do it already. Don't use it. Billy and Billy. Stop. Okay. Stop. okay. stop. You too. Okay. Stop. <laughs> Go to your own corners. Like, no, no. Come. Huh? The is ever. Then shut the f up. up. Ever. You do too. it or shut the f up. Okay. Ever f***ing dig your nails at me like that. Stop it. How f***ing old are you? How f***ing old are you? Shut the f*** up. Sleeping. Guys, stop. Just looking in the mirror just to see if she's okay. And, um, you know, that's what happens when you go to being very violent. It's not going to end very well. Maybe they don't want to see each other again. And, you know, it's really sad because they're family. I don't know if that was fake for the show, which I don't think so. It looks like something was really real. And in case it's fa fake, I'm sorry, this is not something need to be put out there on the TV because that's what people will be learning, that it's okay to treat a family member like that, which I do not agree. We need to be very respectful. And of course, we're not perfect. We do things sometimes that I you know, have to be very honest, that sometimes I know that I can tend to be like very toxic, but you have to recognize yourself that when you have to stop and to not go further with these type of situations. So sadly, um, you see that um, you know this relationship among them it's been like kind of a broken, and you know Corny feel um, you know her that Chloe is not only always taking her side as well, but only just supporting Kim, and she wasn't calling her out even though she also uh, you know caused uh, this uh, horrible fight that in my you know. Um, opinion I don't think it should have just ended the way it did so well I don't know let me know what you think of it uh, what how or what which was your perspective on it and uh, you can just put it in your comment I hope you like it and you know I'm going to continue with this type of videos where I'm going to put every comment that I see from soap operas I'm just going to put videos of anything where I see a behavior that it's you know not acceptable and i'm just going to be describing why i think this is a way of manipulation that it's not okay and you know so on so i hope if you like the the the, the, the video the content of the video you can subscribe and you know i will you from the next week so having i i hope you have a, a great weekend and you know see you